so I've just woken up and today is my brave the shave. I'm ridiculously nervous. I wasn't so much last night. This morning I'm really nervous. I'm excited and scared and nervous and just have like a million emotions right now. So I wanted to vlog this day because I'm proud of doing this. Like I'm proud of creating awareness for Macmillan and I don't know. I just have a lot of emotions right now. So I thought I would try and vlog today to capture this journey and all these emotions that I'm gonna go through. And hopefully this will help someone as well um, who is thinking of doing Brave the Shave or is even going through losing their hair or anything like that. It may help. So yeah, I wanted to vlog this. Um, it's a pretty big thing. Like for a woman to lose their hair and especially a lot of people have been saying to me but don't you think it's going to affect like your job and things like that? Obviously, with being a makeup artist, people see that obviously they think that what I do is just external beauty. And I want to show to everyone that you don't have to have hair to be feminine. Hair is only a part of you. It isn't you. Um, it's just this little piece of me. Um, yeah, I just think that women hold so much identity on their hair and the way they look and how society thinks a woman should look. And I think that women need to realise that you're beautiful, whatever you look like. Like, beauty is within. It's not what new clothes you have, what designer handbag you have, how long your hair is, what colour your hair is, and even your makeup. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to be donating it to the Princess Trust. I've measured my hair. It's long enough. Um, when I first signed up to do the Brave the Shave, I actually had bright red hair. Um, which wasn't, wouldn't have been accepted because it has to be natural hair colours. But now my hair's brown. It's in good condition as well. I have no split ends. Um, and I've measured it and it is long enough to set now. So I'm really happy that I can also donate my hair. So it's two charities that I can help for people who are battling cancer and to support the loved ones that also have to go through the battle alongside them. So yeah, today is going to be a big milestone, I think. Um, I've always wanted to shave my hair off. Like, it's one of them things that I've just always wanted to do. So, I'm excited to do it, but I'm scared. <sighs> I guess... We'll just have to see. I just don't know what I'm going to look like with no hair. And I think that scares me the most. Is not knowing what the outcome's going to look like. <clears throat> I think that scares me the most. And I'm scared that I'm going to cry. Because I'm videoing this. I know people are going to watch this. And I don't want to cry. <laughs> But I think I'm going to cry. And it's just going to be really emotional. I can just tell. Growing up, when I was bullied, my hair was like this security blanket. Like, um, I was always getting it cut and coloured. And it was just like a confidence booster. So since the age of 12, it's been like something I lent on. <laughs> Like, it sounds so weird, it's just hair. It's just hair, it grows back, but 
like I've always taken pride of what I do with my hair but I think you take it for granted people who lose their hair and have no choice either through alopecia or like chemo you don't think of what it's like to lose your hair with no choice this is a choice like I'm choosing to shave my hair people don't have that choice so a bit more makeup on now feel a bit more human <laughs> um, so yeah got the clippers on charge my camera's charging because I want to set one up in the tripod and then hold my phone because um, I'm going to do a Facebook live really nervous now but I'm just at that stage now where I just want it over with I just want it done so yeah um, I'm going to go and plait my hair so I can donate it and then Time to shave. <laughs> oh, so all this is coming off. I have quite thick hair. That's just my fringe. Like that. So all of this is coming off. So, a lot of hair. Plan it all. Plan it all. <laughs> Plan it so I can send it to the Princess Trust so that we can cut it off easier. Yeah, so you should just cut that. Yeah. Let's get this one, okay? They're really tiny plants. Mm -hmm. They're small. So that's when you bring it, okay? There we go. <laughs> Hi everyone! So I'll just wait for some people to come on and then we're gonna do that. I've plaited all my hair because I'm going to be donating it, so you need to plait it. But I did miss <laughs> this bit, so that bit's not plaited, but it's fine. I'm so scared. I'm scared but excited but nervous. So yeah, I had to try, not the neatest, because I had to try and do it myself, but hi! Oh, okay. I know, I don't really come on live much, but this is quite a big thing, so I thought I'd come on live, because everyone wanted me to come on. But I am filming for my a YouTube video as well, so you'll be able to see this. Benny! Yeah. Come on, let's do it. I'm going to cut <laughs> Okay. Oh, I'm so scared. Right, okay. So I'm going to cut off the first one. Um, I didn't make them longer because I've got layers. My fringe was too short. So as you can see, look, it's starting to come out. So I stopped. But they can still use this. Um, it's just so it's plaited so it's neat to send. Okay. Oh, my God. I'm really nervous. <laughs> my hair is so much. Right, okay. <sighs> Let's do this. I'm shaking. <sighs> There's no going back now. <laughs> oh my god! Cut this off. <sighs> well, that that has been been that bad. Oh my god! <laughs> this is emotional. I 
And they're like crazy eyes from Orange is the New Black. I feel with all the plaques. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> my oh, this is more emotional than I thought it'd be. I'm like shaken. Off so far. I'm only gonna do the front one because I'm only gonna have to reach the back. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at my hair. My mum's crying. <laughs> I'm like shaking. grows back this isn't even one percent of what people go through when they're battling cancer Strange. and the family yeah, oh my God. I'm surprised I haven't cried yet I look like a man I might be able to do them all actually <coughs> want to get revenge on me and cut my hair. Yeah, I do want to get hair. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you see the hair like that. I know, I should just say that. Yeah. <laughs> right, I'll do this one and then you can do the rest. Please donate if you're watching, even two pound on the link will help me hit my goal. I think last time I checked I was on 195. So I'm like 55 away from my target. That's amazing. Okay. <laughs> they saw my hair so far. It's all off. Oh my god. So please donate if you're watching. The link is in the description. Every pound counts. I've got an 80s mallet, I know, Mum. Got what? 80s mallet. <laughs> Is that one. last one? <laughs> last one? Oh my god. Thank you, Gemma. Please donate, guys. Oh my god. I bet you are. Hmm? Right, should we get the clippers? Yeah, and scale on one bit side. Hi! Yes. Oh my god, it's so short. Oh my god. Oh, thank you, girls. I'm going to prove that you can still be feminine, you can still be beautiful, even with short hair. Even the back. <laughs> you can donate on the link in the description, and when I come off, I'll pop it in the comments as well. So there's a link in the description of the video. Click that and it'll take you to the Braver Shave profile of mine, and you can donate. Ready? Okay. 
Okay, so I've gone with a grade four. Is it a four? Yeah. Okay, so I've gone with a grade four at first. I think that would be short enough for me, but I can always go to a three after. I just don't want to see skin, that's the only thing. How do you turn it on? <laughs> right, okay. So here we go. Oh my god. Shake it still. Yeah. I think that's still going to be that's too long. Not, that's not a Is it not? No. Why is go, it? I'm going to put a three on. I still feel like this is too long. It's all coming off. I feel like it's too long still. So, I'm going to, Anthony's just going to go and get the three to put on the shaver. And I'm going to go a bit shorter. Because, you know, I want it quite short. So please donate guys, I'm doing the brazier shave for Macmillan and the hair that I cut off here will be sent to the Princess Trust so they can make wigs for children going through cancer. Thank you Lisa. <sighs> okay, just putting the three on. I'm like covered in hair. It's all prickly. Yeah? yeah? Okay, let's see what the three is like. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, that's better. Oh, please donate. <laughs> I'm just like making patterns. My brother's there with his mouth open. <laughs> You're doing very well. I've never used shavers before. Oh my god. I haven't been fully in my natural hair colour since I was like in year six. Best on this thing? At least my brows look good. <laughs> oh, thank you, Debbie. Please donate, guys, if you're watching. I look really different. 
Keep smooth. I wonder how my hair will grow back. Yeah, <laughs> I've got naturally curly hair. Oh, I'm getting prickly. You can do the back. I won't be able to do the back. <laughs> Sinead O'Connor. I can't get this set. Huh? Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> I look so weird. I look so different. Ah, oh, thank you everyone. No, Anthony is going to do the back. I'm actually enjoying this. <laughs> Hair's all over me. Thank you everyone who's donating. Really appreciate it. I know I've got like a, a mullet thing going on. Thank you everyone who's donating. Oh, I just click something. I don't know what it's Mom, doing. Click something. I think I've broken it. Anthony, that oh, moves. Yeah, that's, that's okay. Right, okay. What, it's going to be like lower or something. Right, do you want to do the back? Oh my god! What do you think? I think I look really different. What do you think, Sunday? Good. You like it, do you? Yeah, I do. I just got to do the back now. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, because I'm not an expert with shavers. Alright, that's all. Okay. Please donate if you're watching. I'm surprised I haven't cried. I honestly thought I was going to cry. Because this is proper emotional. Yeah, if you want to donate, the link is in the description of this video. It will take you to my Brave the Shave profile. I can't even remember the last time I had my hair was short. I know, it's really short. It's 
so much coming off still, even after the fat. <laughs> it's really weird stroking your head. Oh. I've got some cute wigs to rock as well on days where I need a bit of confidence and a bit of glam. Hair all over my face. It's like sticking to my powder. If you're watching, please donate. I know, I should get a mohawk with pink. Have like a pink mohawk in the middle. <laughs> it's shorter than yours. Thank you, Hannah. Thank you, Lisa. Charlene. Crazy. I think I'm not gonna have to buy loads of expensive conditioners anymore. It's gonna be amazing. I'm gonna save so much money. No hairspray, no dry shampoo. Probably save electricity as well with the straightener. And the hair dryer. What's yeah. happened? Uh, Mummy's hair fell out. Yes. Yeah, please share. Thank you. The hair feels really fluffy. Is it so fluffy? It does actually. It feels really soft. It's soft. Exactly, Jenny. Okay. You just stick a wig on and go. It's so much easier. It's like a brush. Yeah, yeah, no drying my hair. That used to take forever because it's so thick, my hair. Hey. I need to jump over. Yeah. <laughs> well, I hope I can inspire others to do this, definitely. It's such an amazing charity. Both charities are amazing. I think that's that. Look at me. I'm going to just go do around the ears now. A bit shorter. Well, no, I can't get. I'll be doing videos on the wigs that I wear soon. I've got um, one wig that I'm going to be wearing quite a lot, like a burgundy curly one. Look, a burgundy! And I have some blonde ones anyway that I use for makeup looks on YouTube. Oh, Making these sideburns on it. No, I'm getting all the long bits off. Oh, that's amazing, Emily. Flatter. Nine year old niece will be doing it next month. Oh. <coughs> I won't be wearing wigs all the time, but for some days that I want a bit of confidence boost or just to feel a bit glam, I might be wearing some wigs. I feel alright. Don't step in the hair. I thought I'd cry and I thought I was going to be really emotional. A pro will later. Yeah, when it when it actually hits that I've done this. Oh, I'm feeling pretty good. And my brows look really good. <laughs> you can like see my makeup more now. Oh, thank you. Well, hopefully I see it. I have no choice. <laughs> Huh? 
Go and play, Bubba. No. my target thank you but keep donating please let's see if we can get as much as we can are we done yeah oh my god i'm done so that is my hair now man i need a shower <laughs> there we go i can't believe i've actually just done this like a few years ago i would never I've imagined I would have done anything like this because I'm not a very confident person and hair has always been something that has given me confidence. That's why I change my hair colour a lot, I get different styles. So to do this is actually a really big thing for me and, and hopefully I can inspire others to do it. The hair is only a part of you, it's not you and you don't have to rely on your hair to make you appear feminine and that's just what I wanted to get out there and hopefully can create more awareness of these charities but I can't believe I've done it yeah. let me go by the window there we go so you can see properly there we go I can't believe I've done it. I've actually shaved my hair. It doesn't look that bad. So yeah, thank you to everyone who's watched. Please keep donating anything you can. Like, it really helps. And hopefully I'll be putting up some amazing selfies with my wigs and this hair and things like that. I can't stop seeing it, it feels so fluffy, it feels really fluffy, but yeah, thank you everyone.